Runners sent back on their journey. Muscuri got squeezed, losing a length. Palace Mystery also off the first call. And Life is Fun looking to drop anchor. Oh bloody, oh blood da, came out running by a length and a quarter. Placid sees right there second. White blinkers of Delilah's on the right hand side. And also the white blinkers, black flower, red sleeves and cap in tune just three lengths off. Devon Blue, the orange silks on the inside. A vast park to the inside rail, spots them four length start. Roy's monkey, three parts of a length away. Then comes Muscuri. Life is fun's three around at this point in time. Palace Mysteries bottled up between runners, giving them about seven length start. Towards the inside, Life is fun dropping back a length, and Pit Special is the trailer. Working by the far side of the course as they go past the 1200 meter area. Oh bloody, oh blada, there by a half a length. Placid Seas looking to challenge early on. Delilah's the white blinkers looking to also get that half a length closer. Devon Blue towards the inside. That's in the orange silks. Right there is Black Flower, Black Flower, red sleeves and cap, just two and a half lengths off. Toward the inside of Vast, they're racing in tight quarters up front, Roy's Monkey, then there's two lengths away, Palace Mystery, they're racing in two groups. Palace Mystery heads the second group, hit it running, then comes Pit Special, reminders towards the inside, Muscuri, life is fun. Homeward bound, Placid C takes on Oh Bloody Oh Blada. Delilah's on the outside, Black Flower's just waiting for a way through. A vast also hunting for a gap to the outside and Roy's monkey. Black Flower's got nowhere to go at the 300. Now the gap opens. Placid C, a vast. Toward the inside, Devon Blue. Delilah's running on. A vast comes at Black Flower at the 200. Roy's monkey could also be a danger on the extreme outside. Black Flower, a vast. Roy's monkey, the three of them. Delilah's also trying to re late on black flower delilah roy's monkey and a vast delilah's coming home at black flower and probably delilah's gonna get up on the line it's close maybe delilah black flower roy's monkey and also look at pit special three strides past the line pit specials in front the race the last hundred meters you could throw a blanket over them black flower coming home hard at the business end it's desperately close maybe delilah on the nod but let's just get back into the slow-mo over the last hundred, they both got the white blinkers. Black Flower had her head in front, and Delilah closest to us is going to come late. Black Flower, Delilah's going to put her nose down, put special on the inside. Let's see as they hit the line. Black Flower, Delilah probably got there. Yes, Delilah, number one Delilah. Black Flower, maybe just second. Put special, Roy's monkey, maybe Roy's monkey closest to us, third. Pit special, well, how's that? A head separating the first quartet, a neck separating the first five. A vast is just off them, and this is a race that any one of four, five runners over the last hundred could have won it. Number one, Delilah, looks like she's scraped home from Black Flower. Pit special looms towards the inside late on. Black Flower was looking for the gap. Delilah runs a big race because they went past Delilah 200 to go and then starts to re-rally. You'll see it gets very tight and Delilah, she rises up to the challenge. She wants that gap there and she fights on courageously. Alec Forbes, there you'll see they actually bump close home. Black Flower, Delilah, they bump one another and a stride past Spit Specials in front towards the outside. Roy's Monkey. So let's just wait on this. Number one, Delilah probably gets there. You'll notice Black Flower and Delilah, they just brush inside the last two strides. Pit special, Roy's monkey. What a tremendous finish. Back to the studio. Well, we've seen a very close finish here, and uh, Delilah's got its head down when it counted. It looked like things weren't going in the favor of uh, Lazan's horses. It looked a struggle all the way up the stretch. Yeah, uh, it was a very exciting finish. You know, it's always wonderful when you're the one that gets your head down where it matters most. And uh, yeah, I thought very, very courageous effort by the filly. I want to say a big thank you to all the owners for their support and uh, congratulations especially to Preston Thomas. This is his first horse and his first winner. So it's a very special day for him and I'm very sad that he couldn't be here. Uh, and to Sonu and to, to Chris, you know, they, they all... Um, great supporters of mine in the yard and they've been uh, you know sticking by her and she, she's been knocking on the door and putting up some good efforts and yeah very very nice for her to win today. What about the rest of your card? Um, I've got two fillies in race eight 
Um, I think Mad Pushpa, uh, she's a bit of a quirky filly and she's having her first run for me. Uh, she might need this one, um, but she seems like quite a nice filly. And then uh, Magokachi's really, really well. She just uh, might have a work cut out from a bad draw. Thanks for your help. Thanks so much. Here's Alec. Well, Alec, it looked tough all the way around. They had you out wide early. You, you, it, was, it was never easy. Then it looked like they had your number half of the stretch, but uh, she wouldn't give up. No, she didn't give up. Well, you know, um, I was actually quite happy out there because when she's in behind horses, uh, her, her action's restricted, and she was happy and turned for home and made my move, and she went and went all the way to the line, sort of staying on. The other horses joined her, and she, um, she showed quite a bit of uh, resolution to, to hang in there. Yeah, it looked like you weren't going to win, and then it suddenly looked like you weren't going to lose. <laughs> <laughs> I did think I, I was going to run second to Anton. He, he actually headed me quite nicely, and um, then his horse started to hang, which gave me another, you know, chance. Yeah. How's the rest of your card look? Something else from your side? Paul uh, Buster Brown must be in with a big shot yeah. from his draw today. And uh, Vampirella in the last, uh, I think she'll be in the first three. Thanks for your help. Thank you. Yeah, well done to all the owners of the source, Delilah, especially the owner who's having his first win. And uh, well done to Greystone Stud, that's Sinjin, well done to him, this Jam Alley, daughter of Jam Alley, has won a tough race.